Welcome to Bedtime Story from the George Hall for the Young Center. My name is Miss Patricia and I'm happy that you are here today. All of our bedtime, all of our story time incorporate how does learning happen. The four foundations of learning are belonging, well-being, engagement, and expression. When children feel a sense of belonging and a sense of well-being, they are in a better position to engage and ex express their ideas. So my friends, now let's sing our welcome song. The more we get together, 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 the more we get together, the happier we'll be. Because your friends are my friends, and my friends are your friends. The more we get together, the happier we'll be. So my friend, let's shake our sillies out. We're going to shake, shake, shake our sillies out. Shake, shake, shake our sillies out. Shake, shake, shake our sillies out. And we go the waggles away. We're going to clap. Clap, clap our sillies out, clap, clap, clap our sillies out, clap, clap, clap our sillies out, and wiggles the waggles away. We gonna jump, jump, jump our jiggles out, jump, jump, jump our jiggles out, jump, jump, jump our jiggles out, and wiggles the waggles away. So my friends, I have a poem that I'm going to do. It's moon so wrong and yellow. Moon so wrong and yellow, looking from on high. Shining, how I love to see you, shining in the sky. Oft and oft I wonder, when I see you there, how they get to light you, hanging in the air. Where you go at morning, when the night is past, and the suns come peeping, or the hills at last. Sometimes I will watch you slowly overhead. When you think I'm sleeping, I'm snuggled in my bed. I have another poem, and the name of it is Little Night Owl. Once there was a night owl who lived in a tree. He could could often spot things that others couldn't see. Little night owl, answer me, what do you see? As you sit alone at night, up in the tree. So my friends, what do we do before we get ready for bed? You're right, we brush our teeth. So let's sing. This is the way we brush our teeth, brush our teeth, brush our teeth. This is the way we brush our teeth before we get ready for bed. This is the way we brush our teeth, brush our teeth, brush our teeth. This is the way we brush our teeth before we get ready for bed. And as we finish brushing our teeth, what do we do? We put our pajamas on. So let's put our pajamas on and put our top on. So we all ready now. So I have a little song, Flickering Bright Firefly. Flickering bright fireflies growing in the winter night. Flashing lanterns in the sky, the nice little beautiful lullaby. Flickering bright fireflies glowing in the winter night. Well, Miss Friend, Miss Friend, Miss Patricia, have a book so she can take a seat. And I have a book here, and it's the very friendly firefly and it's written by Jack Tickle. Lots of nighttime animals are hiding in this book. 
waiting to pop out at you. So come, let's take a look. Bats, bats like dangling upside down. He looks a silly sight. He does all day and then goes batting in the night. And there is my bat. Cicadas. Cicadas like to stay awake and nather in the trees. He makes a chitter chatter sounds by waggle, waggling his knees. And there is our cicada. Bush Baby. Bush Baby is small and shy. She's frightened of the light, but she likes playing peekaboo up in the trees all night. And there she is playing peekaboo. Fancy Foxes. Fancy Foxes, the flurry, flurry fancy foxes love to scamper round and round. They look as though their floppy ears could lift them off the ground. There they are. Here is their floppy ears. Fireflies. Fireflies has a beaming grin. He's such a handsome fellow. And when he greets his fly firefly love, his tail starts glowing yellow. So here's his tail here and it is glowing yellow. Armadillo. Armadillo curls up tight, just like a big rock. Then she puts her head out and she gave the bug a shock. Here it is, there's her head popping out here. Owl blinks her big wrong eyes and hoots, to it, to who, while baby all jump out to play with a big tee wit, tee who, who. And here is baby all right here. Jaguars, a lazy bone, he likes a lot of sleep. He nods off every day by day, counting spots instead of sheep. The animals can play all night until the bright sunrise. Then they, then they curl up warm and snug and shut their sleepy eyes. The end. My friend, this is a very good book. So let's do a little bit of breathing. So we're gonna breathe in through our nose and out through our mouth. So when I breathe in through my nose, the ball will expand and through my mouth, it will close. So let's go. So, Miss Patricia, I have another book here for you. And the title of the book is They Were Ten in the Bed. And it's written by Susan Calarati. So, let's see what will happen. And I'm actually going to sing it to you guys. They were ten in the bed, and the little one said, Crawl over, crawl over. So they all rolled over, and one fell out. 
They were nine in the bed and the little one said, roll over, roll over. So they all rolled over and one fell out. They were eight in the bed and the little one said, roll over, roll over. So they all rolled over and one fell out. Hmm, I wonder how many leaves. You're right, it is seven. They were seven in the bed and the little one said, roll over, roll over. So they all roll over and one fell out. But who can tell me what number we're at? Yes. We are at six. They were six in the bed and the little one said, roll over, roll over. So they all roll over and one fell out. What number we're at now? Yes, we are at five. They were five in the bed and the little one said, roll over, roll over. So they all roll over and one fell off. Mm. Yes, we are at four. They were four in the bed and the little one said, roll over, roll over. So they all roll over and one fell out. They were three in the bed and the little one said, roll over, roll over. So they all roll over and one fell out. Yes, you're right. We are a two. Thank you, my friends, for helping. They were two in the bed and the little one said, roll over, roll over. So they all roll over and one fell out. There was one in the bed and the little one said, I found it. So what do you think he find, my friends? What were they rolling up of the bed looking for? Who can guess and tell me? Look at the picture and tell me what they were looking for. What did he find? You are right. They were looking for the bone yes and the last one found the bone the end okay <clears throat> i have another song here the sun comes up to start start the day the sun comes up to start the day there's time to learn and time to play we eat our meals and do our chores. It's family time and so much more. At night the moon comes out to shine. It's time to get ready for our bedtime. We rest our head and close our eyes to start the twinkling in the skies. So my friends, I think it's about time for us to get ready to go. So this is the way we say goodbye, say goodbye, say goodbye. This is the way we say goodbye. Our story time is over. This is the way we say goodbye, say goodbye, say goodbye. This is the way we say goodbye. Our story time is over. Goodbye, my friend.